this video you're watching right now was recorded without a microphone on the camera i intentionally did this to prove to you that there's an ai tool that can enhance your audio to make it sound like you recorded your audio in a professional studio with all these expensive microphones now take a listen to this audio this video you're watching right now was recorded without a microphone on the camera i intentionally did this to prove to you that there's an ai tool that can enhance your audio to make it sound like you recorded your audio in a professional studio with all these expensive microphones this same audio is recorded without a microphone but it sounds much better and professional so in this video i'm going to take you through how to enhance your trash audio to make it sound professional and pleasing to the ear using just one ai tool so if you're a content creator that is just starting now among so many important things you need to pay attention to is your audio your video could look more attractive with much more enhanced camera quality but if your audio is not sounding pleasing trust me nobody would watch your video and we we'll agree that once you are just starting you probably will not have money to invest in microphones so sit back and follow the steps as i take you to how to enhance your trash audio using an AI tool called Adobe Podcast Enhancer. So after you have taken your time to record your video from start to finish, the next thing you'd want to do is to edit your video using any video editing software of your choice. There are so many video editing software you can use, but for someone who is just starting up, I would highly recommend you go in for CapCut. The most reason I'm recommending CapCut is because it is very easy to use and also it is free. The next thing you would want to do is to extract your audio from the video and the tool that is going to help us extract our audio from the video is VLC. VLC is a media player that is used to play videos and audios on our computers. So just go straight to open up VLC and if you don't have VLC media player you can simply download it on Google. It is free. The steps are quite the same if you are using Windows. So once you open up VLC on your Windows you come and click on media then you scroll down to convert or save but if you are using Mac you rather come and click on file and scroll down to convert or stream once you click on convert slash stream this dialog box will open then you navigate to the video you want to extract the audio from let me just move this a bit here then come and drag the file and drop it on here then you come to the profile option and click the drop down arrow then you scroll down to audio mp3 slash mp4 with this customized option you wouldn't want to change anything from here so i'll just leave it as it is and click on apply and then you come and click on save as file then you click on browse rename the file as you like then you click on save then you click on the save here just be mindful that it wouldn't give you any alert once the audio is finished extracting. And once it's done, that is all to it. But the most easiest way to extract your audio from your video is to export only the audio after you have finished editing the entire video. This could be done on any video editing software you are using. Let me quickly teach you how to export only your audio in CapCut. So once you have finished editing your videos and you hit the export option, once this dialog box open for you to export your video, simply come and check this audio option and then you uncheck this video option and then you make sure you choose a destination to where you can have easy access to the audio file and once that is done you just come and hit on export the entire export will only be for the audio and not with the video at this point if you are finding value so far support this channel by giving this video a like that's your way of encouraging me to keep making videos of this kind i honestly would appreciate your effort for liking this video it will really mean so much to me. And don't also forget to subscribe to this channel to be part of our amazing community of subscribers. Feel free to let me know if you have just subscribed in the comments and I'll reply you with a special message welcoming you to our amazing community of subscribers. So Adobe Podcast Enhancer is an AI tool that enhances your trash audio to something that sounds like your audio is being recorded in a professional studio. So you first of all would have to create an account by clicking on sign up. Then you can use either your Gmail, Facebook or Apple ID. For me, I would use my Gmail. Okay, so select any of them you wish to use and then go ahead with the login your account will just take some seconds to be set up so what you do is that drag your trash audio from the video you edited and if you already have the audio lying down somewhere just drag it on here 
So you just wait a bit and you can see the AI tool has begun enhancing the audio. For this audio, it's going to take us up to 10 minutes. So if your audio is longer than mine, it's going to take you quite longer time than this. So once the AI tool has finished doing the job, it gives you a notification that your audio is ready with the enhanced speech enabled. So you can go ahead to preview the audio by clicking on this or you just download the audio right away. And if you have another file, you can upload it too for it to be enhanced. So I just go ahead and click on the download button. So with all these, there are some things you need to put in consideration. One, if you are not using a microphone on your camera like I'm doing, make sure to speak out loud enough. What you don't have to do is make sure you are not shouting on top of your voice. This will make the AI tool not to over process your audio and at the end making your audio sound terrible. Another thing you also have to do is make sure your camera or your phone that you are using to record is closer to you. This will make the camera or the phone you are using to record takes in the audio properly. Another thing is if you have a spare phone, turn on the voice recorder on that spare phone put it closer to you and make sure it's not showing in the video turn on the voice recorder so that it can take your audio separately and when you do this the audio on the voice recorder from your separate phone will sound much more better than the audio from your camera you can later on sync the audio from your voice recorder to the audio you recorded with your camera all right that is it guys if you're able to follow these steps your audio should improve and sound much professional in your next video also if you are starting up your youtube channel and you are trying to figure out how to go about it you should watch this video to know which free ai tools you should use to get started it will help you get more views this will help your channel get monetized quicker so you could also make some money as a content creator